Hey guys, in this video we are going to show you how you can transform and improve your hair by using K18. We're going to show you how we went from this to this by using K18 and you will learn all about their newest product which is the K18 Molecular Repair Hair Oil. We are going to go over what the oil does and how to use the oil for maximum strengthening and repair results. And you will also learn what the difference is between the Molecular Repair Mask and the Molecular Repair Oil. By the end of this video you should be a K18 expert and you will learn professional tips you can use to your advantage. We will go over all of their products and how you can incorporate them into your life to help you achieve lasting and progressive hair health. The world of K18 can be confusing at first but we are here to simplify it for you. There's a lot to go over so let's not waste any time and get right into it. The first step is to use the Peptide Prep Pro Chelating Hair Complex. You're going to start on dry hair. The formula contains enough water to start the cuticle swelling process without having to wet the hair and this is going to help you save time. Applying the chelator on dry hair will also provide maximum efficacy of the product. Start by sectioning the hair into 4 quadrants. Shake the bottle well before use. Apply 6 to 10 sprays of the chelator to each quadrant. You can start with 6 sprays per quadrant and then increase up to 10 as needed based on the length and density of the hair. Make sure the hair is lightly damp after applying the chelator. You don't want the hair wet or dripping. Comb each section through to ensure even distribution of the product and then wait 4 minutes to allow the chelator to process. Every person will benefit from a chelating treatment. A chelator acts as a strong magnet pulling metals and minerals out of the hair. The chances are high that there is some level of mineral and metal buildup in your hair. Signs of buildup can look like dull, discolored, rough, and damaged looking hair. Also, if your products aren't working well or if you are exposed to pool or ocean water. The chelator is used before every salon service and it is okay to use it on unwashed, dirty hair unless the hair is excessively dirty. This is a product that is to be used in the salon as it's a stronger targeted approach to chelating and it is designed for professional use. It's specifically engineered to focus on removing metal and mineral ions from buildup. By using the K18 Pro Chelating Hair Complex, you can expect a more vibrant and even color after a chemical or color service. Bleached hair will look brighter after treatment and it will help to reduce unexpected chemical reactions. It's also going to reset your hair's texture and it will give you a clean canvas to work with for better effectiveness of treatments and styling products you would use afterwards. Next, without rinsing the hair out, you're going to spray the K18 Professional Molecular Repair Hair Mist directly on top of the chelator. The amount of sprays you use per quadrant will depend on the size of the bottle you have and the length and density of the hair. For the 300ml bottle, you would use 4 to 9 sprays per quadrant and for the 150ml bottle, you would use 6 to 12 sprays. They are the same product but the bigger bottle will allow for faster and easier application due to the trigger spray. Again, you're going to wait 4 minutes after application of the mist and do not rinse the hair. Next, you're going to dry the hair if needed and then perform the desired chemical service. The mist is typically used before chemical services to help renew existing damage in the hair. It will strengthen the hair's defense against damaging chemical services. It's going to open the cuticle layer of the hair so that the hair's cortex can be penetrated and the K18 peptide can enter to the damaged sites on a molecular level. The K18 peptide will reconnect broken keratin chains responsible for the hair's core strength and elasticity. It mimics the molecular makeup of keratin to reinforce strength along the length and the width of the hair fiber. This will help create a strong canvas to work on for successful chemical services. For my service, we applied lightener and then rinsed and shampooed with a K18 Peptide Prep Detox Shampoo and did not condition the hair. The Detox Shampoo is a non-stripping clarifying shampoo. It's different from the chelator as it's going to mainly target product buildup removal and sebum. After shampooing, towel dry the hair and then dispense 1-3 to three pumps of the K18 Molecular Repair Hair Mask into your hands based on the length, density, and condition of the hair. It's important to not exceed 3 pumps of the mask as this is the maximum recommended usage. The thickest or most curly coily hair uses a maximum of 3 pumps. Start by using one pump and then massage the product between your palms until it thickens. Start applying the mask at the ends of the hair and then work your way up towards the roots. Always begin with one pump and then increase the pumps as needed up to three pumps maximum. Wait four minutes and do not rinse the hair. Next, we tone the hair by using a special technique. 
The toner is applied directly over the mask. To prepare the bath, we mix 10 volume developer with a K18 pH maintenance shampoo in a 1 to 1 ratio and then whisk the mixture together to create a nice foam. Next, add the custom color formula, use permanent color and continue to whisk the mixture together to create a nice and even blend. Proceed to pour the mixture over the hair and make sure to apply it to the inside of the hair so that it is evenly distributed throughout all of the hair. The benefits of this is that it is fast and easy to apply. It will save you time and you will have a nice, even and fast result without wasting lots of your time. You will see results in 5-10 to 10 minutes and you can also use this technique to refresh a hair color without a bleaching service or do a color correction. The color will hold on the hair for a longer period of time and you will also use less of the product. Next, simply rinse the hair thoroughly and do not condition the hair. Towel dry the hair and apply the mask again following the same application method method as earlier. Wait 4 minutes and don't rinse the hair out as this is a leave-in product. The mask is going to repair damage from bleach and color, chemical services and heat. It's also going to close down the hair cuticle to seal in the K18 peptide for renewed strength and elasticity of the hair. The reason you do not condition the hair prior to application of the mask is because conditioner will leave a film on the hair that will block the K18 peptide from penetrating the hair effectively. The mask is a highly concentrated treatment which restores hair in the innermost layers of the hair, whereas traditional conditioners coat the outside of the hair. Lastly, finish with the Molecular Repair Hair Oil. After you've waited 4 minutes after application of the mask, you can apply 1-3 to three drops of the oil to damp hair directly on top of the mask and build as needed. Start at the ends and work your way up through the mid lengths of the hair. Wait 4 minutes for strengthening benefits from the K18 peptide in the oil and then style as usual. Apply an additional 1-3 to three drops of the oil to dry hair as a finisher. To get the most effective repair and styling benefits, let the mask sit for 4 minutes before applying the oil. This will give you enhanced softening and styling benefits by using the oil after you have applied the mask and waited the 4 minute processing time. The mask will not block the molecular repair hair oil from penetrating so you can safely layer them without impacting the oil's performance. You can use the oil on both damp hair before styling and on on dry hair as a finisher to add shine. The oil is a highly concentrated formula so you don't need to use a lot of it. Build up the product as needed. You will need to use less of the oil on dry hair and more on damp hair. The Molecular Repair Hair Oil is a weightless oil that is engineered to strengthen and repair damaged hair. This is a unique oil because it's going to help reduce frizz not by just smoothing the frizz and flyaways but by addressing the damage that causes frizz long term. The formula of the oil contains the casein peptide and works at the molecular level to repair damaged hair which is more susceptible to frizz. So ultimately this oil works on two levels of the hair fiber, the molecular level and the surface level. This oil will not leave buildup on the hair or weigh it down. The oil is vegan and contains sunflower oil, hemi squalane and squalane which is going to smooth the hair cuticle and soften the hair without weighing it down. They are going to reinforce the hair's natural moisture barrier and reduce frizz and enhance shine. Damaged hair loses its natural water-resistant barrier and the oils in the formula will help to reinforce the barrier to reduce frizz. Therefore, you can use this oil to help fight frizz and humidity. It also contains avocado oil which has one of the highest smoking points and will help provide 450 degrees Fahrenheit of heat protection so you should use it before heat styling. This oil can be used daily and will work on all hair types, not only frizzy hair. Ultimately, by using the full K18 routine as you just saw, you will get an optimal service and molecular repair results. It will allow for maximum damage repair pre and post service plus additional styling, smoothing and strengthening benefits with the oil. You can use the K18 routine at home for maintenance to keep the hair healthy in between your appointments. Lastly, I want to mention with K18 you should trust the process and let it work its magic. Make sure you are lathering the mask correctly and giving it the 4 minutes to work. A lot of you will find that you may not need conditioner if you do everything correctly. As you can see my hair gets very tangled and difficult to manage but by using the mask with the oil and waiting the 8 minutes I was able to skip conditioner from this routine and did not use any other styling products. However, if you feel you absolutely need to add conditioner, a leave-in or any type of product then you can do so once the 4 minute time frame is up. For more information on the K18 line, you can check out our other K18 videos. Thank you guys for watching and don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more hair related videos. See you guys soon.